In this illustration, we intend to simulate hysteresis analysis of the moment connection with or without RBS in the Abacus software. In this question, first connection of beam to column is subjected to a cyclic loading and its hysteresis diagram will be drawn afterwards. In the next step, connection of RBS to column is subjected uh, to a cyclic loading and a hysteresis diagram will be drawn. After that, the results of both will be compared together. In these two pictures, uh, the hysteresis diagram obtained from the Abacus software has been compared with those results mentioned in the article. Also, in these pictures, the deformation of the model undergoing the cyclic loading can be observed. As you observe in this picture, the plastic hinge moves away uh, from the column when RBS beam is being utilized. Actually, we intend to simulate this article in the Alcas software. The article is entitled Study of Steel Moment Connection with and without reduced beam section. In this picture, uh, hysteresis diagrams have been drawn in which the left image is related to the model without RBS and the right one pertains to the RBS beam model. In the next step, we intend to draw the hysteresis diagram of the model. Actually, uh, we are going to trace this diagram. I will click on Create XPy Data, ODB History Output, and Continue. Here, I'll select all reaction forces. Click on Save As. Here, select sum and click on OK. Then I will select displacement, click on save as and OK. I will click on create XPy data, then on operate on XPy data and continue. 
Here I will select Combine, first U2, then select Total Force, and then click on Save. Here you observe the hysteresis diagram of the model. I will transfer that to the Excel software. The first column is displacement, the unit of which is millimeter. And the second column is force, the unit of which is newton. The diagram having been drawn with red color is the one obtained from the Abacus software. As you observe the results obtained from the Abacus software are very close to those mentioned in the article, indicating that this question has been simulated correctly and uh, properly in our case software. In the next step, I intend to solve this question using RBS Beam. I'll click on Model menu, then Copy Model, Model 1. I will name this model RBS. Then I will go to the part module. Here I should convert the simple beam into RBS beam. To do so, I will click on create cut extrude. First, I'll select this plane, then this line. I will click on create arc and draw a semicircle like this. The distance between these two points is 60 millimeters. This distance is equal to 160 millimeters. This one is equal to 25 millimeters. and the radius is equal to 140.5 millimeters. In the next step, I will click on Mirror, Copy. I will select this line as the rotation axis, then select Semicircle and Done. In the next step, I will complete the semicircles Click on Done and OK. 
in this manner. I will enter mesh module here I'll click on assign mesh control and select the beam flanges here I'll select quad and structure and OK then I will click on mesh part and yes Here I intend to draw the hysteresis diagram of the model. Actually, I intend to draw this hysteresis diagram. To do so, I'll click on Create XPy Data, select ODB History Output, and continue. Here I'll sum up all reaction forces. Click on Create XY Data. Here, select Operate on XY Data and continue. Here, I'll select Combine. First, select Displacement and then Total Force and click on Save As. Here, you observe the drawn hysteresis diagram. I will transfer that to the Excel software. The first column is displacement, the unit of which is millimeter. And the second one is force, the unit of which is newton.
Here the diagram drawn with blue color is the one having been obtained from the Abacus software. As you observe, the results obtained from the Abacus software are very close to those mentioned in the article, indicating that this question has been simulated correctly and properly in the Abacus software.